baby. I be whipping. So okay. No, ma'am. Can I do Afterpay? Not Afterpay, Apple Pay. I'm not new to this, I'm true to this. my channel today's video as you can see from the title i do think i plan on putting this with my moving series four um since we're going to be doing a lot of apartment related home decor related things in this video so if you're new here hey my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so i have like whew, 15 items coming from amazon within the next um, two to three days I got one package here so we're gonna go ahead and open this in this vlog I plan to show y'all everything that I got all of my like 14 items um, we're gonna be kind of juicing up my apartment as well as organizing and kind of like cleaning up my guest bedroom closet and my laundry room just organizing a little bit like it'll probably take like five minutes from the laundry room and then like 10 minutes for the guest closet but this is the first package they're going to be at random so over the next like three days i'm going to drag this video out because i'm waiting on my packages and i could not wait to open this box for what three more days so and like i said it's just random stuff that i had like in my wish list well on my wish list in my cart just different things like that that i'm like here like just go ahead and buy it like just go ahead and get it so i got four items today like i said they are a complete random and first off why is my stuff open girl okay the first thing this isn't pertaining to the apartment but i got a one two three four five six a six piece brush set if you guys remember maybe like two vlogs ago i uh, um i always do my own pedicures and stuff but i recently got the poly gel and so i've been needing these specific brushes to be able to really do the application a lot better than i've been doing and to be able to do the french tip with that little bitty thin brush so got that that's random the other thing that I got is this wallpaper. I plug in this video here. I put up wallpaper in my bedroom and I am missing like a little bitty corner. So I got one row, literally like the smallest row that I could get. Hopefully the color matches up pretty well because I don't know what it is, but when you buy multiple of these, like the color isn't always exact. So if you look right here, I don't have any wallpaper right there so that's where this wallpaper is going to go we're the just next thing i got is this um electric candle lighter like what person don't have this <laughs> but comes with the usb charger and everything i've been who girl eyeballing this for like two years probably so it comes with a little usb to recharge it and let's take it out the one i got was only like it was like under ten dollars it was like eight dollars and something so i think they said it already came charged and then yes yeah, so you'll do that and then i guess press this button right here yep oh i can't wait to light a candle okay so i got that let me not lose this usb girl because i got cords everywhere and then the last thing i got in this is a the brand honey bull everything will be linked to my amazon storefront the fogless shower mirror i literally had to y'all see i got my natural hair out so i took out my sew in and i was in the shower and i'm like Ugh. every time i do this i wish that i would have went ahead and been bought this because i obviously co-wash i co-wash my hair shampoo and condition and deep condition and girls sometimes i be needing to see and y'all know i got a walk-in shower with like the rainfall shower head and stuff so it's like i be needing to make sure i got all the soap and stuff at my head so i'm super excited to put this up um i know i want to do a tiktok as well so i may or may not show well no i got that anyways I plan on doing a TikTok for upgrading my bathroom. Like, I got some stuff for my guest bathroom because I have a bathtub in that one. I don't have a tub in my extra master ba uh, bathroom back there, just a walk-in shower. So, oops, we're going to be 
making that feel like a spa so i have the cute little like spa table tray that you put in there for when you take a bubble bath i got a pillow to lay back like i got a bunch of stuff girl so i'm waiting on some stuff i don't want to spoil it i want to show y'all when it get here but right now it's 2 49 i'm about to go ahead and post this sunday reset youtube video um and then i'm gonna light me a candle with this and i am about to go ahead and try to put up this wallpaper because that'd be easy and i think what i want to do today is kind of just focus on laundry i kind of already cleaned a little bit today um but yeah my laundry is getting backed up girl so i'm gonna organize my laundry room area i'm going to do laundry and actually fold the clothes and put them away and i think that's pretty much what i'm going to do today i called into work yesterday because my throat was hurting and i just wasn't feeling good i was tired and when we got back from vegas nikki had texted me like two days later and was saying like do i feel sick or anything because they had got sick so i think it kind of matter like might have hit me a little bit but not too bad so i don't have any day cool i just got night cool so i'll probably take night cool at like nine o'clock tonight and yeah so and i'm tired i've been watching just youtube videos all day so after i post this video i'm gonna go ahead and put up this wallpaper i have two videos ready to be uploaded so this one i'm gonna go ahead and upload it like 10 minutes early because I'm about to be busy, like, doing laundry and stuff, so I may forget to upload it in 10 minutes. So, yeah, I made the thumbnail, made the title, everything's good. I got my ads going, and I believe I did Tom Sampson everything. So, right here, we're going to change it from unlisted to public. And this is Sunday Reset, so this should be out before y'all watching this video, so make sure y'all have seen this one. And then, yeah, I got everything ready. We're going to go ahead and save. And then what I like to do is go to the video. It says nothing to do with the apartment. Healthy or new, a new anti-aging line from Cetaphil. <laughs> because sensitive skin can handle a lot, but yes, I not care to videos. go inside Walmart anymore. Like, oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, babe. Yes. Like, baby, why are you minding my business? Mind your business. I mean, waking up early is definitely that girl. Talk to your... Okay. Whoever that is, y'all are cute. Okay. Then I'm going to go here. Care to go inside Walmart anymore? I'm like, this oh God, okay, baby. Let's like, baby. Mm -hmm. So me and Bay had went out to eat um, the other day and I didn't show in the other vlog. Well, I showed in the vlog that I used this. I'll have this linked in my Amazon storefront. It's literally your own like 
silverware for when you go out to eat. And so I just use the fork and the knife. So I'm gonna throw this in the dishwasher and wash it. It also comes with a spoon. It comes with two metal straws. And then it also comes, well, it comes with one metal straw, chopsticks, and then a little straw brush cleaner. So I absolutely love that. I got it for Christmas like a year or two ago. It's like $12. So throw these in the dishwasher and then make sure to put them back up. Um, literally, it's so, so convenient and it's so small. Literally comes in this little thing and then it has a pouch and I just keep this in my purse at all times. Cause girl, I'm always need that. So right now, I got a load of clothes in the washer. Take my glasses off, cause it's not giving. <laughs> I got a load of clothes in the washer right now. So I'm just about to take out everything that's in here and then we're gonna organize it. And I also have to put away my towels and then I have another load of clothes, but we're not even gonna talk about that. So this is what we're working with. This is how it looks before doing anything to it. It just looks a mess. Like I said, it's not gonna take long to organize. Got my bags over here. That's what I had up there. So I feel like the best way for me to do this is just to lay everything out so I can see what I have. Jury in a safe on arrival, pistol on J for survival. A lot of people gunning for the title, a lot of people trying to take us viral. I'm just trying to have a nice night, the waiter brought a check for the meal. She said, Babe, I think this was a typo. Nah, girl, I got it, that's like, yo, I can show you bigger things than that. It's gonna be a minute till I'm back. Let me get your images that last. Amex had a limit in the past. I had plenty women in the past. I done plenty sinning in the past. Y'all don't need to know, but you can ask. Sticking on your backstage pass. All access, cause you bad. You could go wherever with that ass. Show to the shower, to the truck. Club to the club for the party. You go in first with your girl. Cause I don't know who's out there watching. But I do know one thing though. Women, they come, they go. Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday, Sunday, yo. Maybe I'll love you one day. Maybe we'll someday grow. So what you put your bra in to protect it so I got one like that and then I got another one and then this one is just the garment bag as well so I think I'm gonna put like the garment bags and stuff in here along with my reusable shopping bags And my reusable mopping pads. This is clean. It just looks like that. And then this one's clean. And this one's clean. <clears throat> or no, I think I'm just gonna keep that for like the bags. Bitches, we the best music. music. Another one. Yeah. Another one. DJ Khaled! Bitch is calling my phone like I'm locked up non-stop. From the plane to the fucking helicopter, yo. Cops pulling up like I'm giving drugs out, ah, nah, nah. I'm a pop star, not a doctor. Just calling my phone like I'm locked up non-stop. From the plane to the fucking helicopter, yo. Cops pulling up like I'm giving drugs out, ah, nah, nah. I'm a pop star, not a doctor. Hey, shorty with the long text, I don't talk to Shorty with the long legs, she on the Yeah, last shit I kept it on the top. Hey. Take as many charges as it needs to. 
forgot I had this steamer. I think I may actually use this today. I haven't used it yet. It was $14.99 at Marshall's. Um, I am going to put it right here though since like it just makes sense to go right there. So I'm going to keep it out and I'm going to use it for the first time. I think I want to actually steam my sheets. Not my sheets. My curtains because they are a little wrinkly. So I would like to steam them. See to kind of get some of these wrinkles out. But we'll do that a little later. I'm gonna keep it in here so I remember to do that. And I'm about to put my food on right now because girl, I'm hungry. And then I have this load of clothes to put up, that basket of clothes to put up, and then I gotta put these clothes that just got done in the washer in the dryer. These aren't too many, so we're just gonna go ahead and knock these out real quick. So I ran out of, y'all know I like to do the Velveeta. So I literally had macaroni in the pantry. So I decided just to kind of make my own homemade mac and cheese. So that's why you see me doing it like that. I didn't feel like doing no baked macaroni. So I had a few elbow shells and then I had some cheese, put some milk and some butter, salt, pepper. And yeah, that's how I made my macaroni for tonight since I ran out. And for my mashed potatoes, I like to throw in some heavy whipping cream, add in some garlic powder, salt, pepper, onion powder, all of that. And I like to put all of that in the pan first most of the time. And then I would throw the potatoes back in there and then I'll start mashing them. I like creamy whipped mashed potatoes with a little bit of like shredded cheese in there. Like so cheesy, creamy mashed potatoes, if you will. So you will probably see me throw in a little bit of cheese as well. Um, yeah, I just like fluffy, cheesy mashed potatoes. <laughs> I 
I've been watching too much Gordon Ramsay because why was I trying to practice on plating? Like I'm up on Master Chef. <laughs> if you know, you know. Y'all know I love Gordon Ramsay and I done binge watched all of Master Chef from season one to season 15 or 13, whatever it is. Girl, I'm thinking I'm going to Ramsey trying to figure out how I want to play stuff. At that point, I was like, you know what, just forget it. So I just started <laughs> throwing everything on the plate. But it was so good. Meal was a 10 out of 10 for sure. All right. Hey, y'all. It's a new day. It's a new day. It is 12.14. I woke up at like 8 or 9 o'clock. I went to the gym to go and cancel my personal training membership or whatever. Um... I was talking to my trainer. She had texted me a few days ago, or whatever. But honestly, I went every Monday, if y'all care about this. If not, you can skip to when I'm opening up my packages and stuff. But I had originally, I've been going every Monday or whatever. And then I put my account on a 30 day freeze. And then I got to thinking about it. And so I'm with 10 Fitness. So if y'all have a 10 Fitness where y'all at or whatever, um, Team Fitness takes out your account every two weeks. So that's my gym membership. And my gym membership is like $16, $17. I got like one of the middle ones, like not the highest one, but not the lowest one, but you know, like right in the middle premium. So mine is like $16 and some change. And then the personal training, she knocked my stuff down to $30 instead of $35, but that's $30 every two weeks. <clears throat> and uh, yeah so it's been $60 taken out my account every two weeks on top of the $16 and some change added that up that's $153 and some change each month for the gym no ma'am <laughs> so I had called this morning and he was like well you know like why are you canceling I said because I'm paying 150 something dollars each month and that's insane thank you like can I cancel now <laughs> so I had to do it in there, so I went up there, canceled that, and he was like, I could do it to every two weeks, you know, to save some money, or like, it's just like, I don't got time for that. And plus, I don't like to have to like, cancel and reschedule stuff. Like, I would text her, and it's like, you know, I can't come to this, like, let's reschedule. And I don't know, my schedule is just too busy. I don't like, I say this all the time, I don't like to be on other people's time. So, when I know like that's her time and it's just, it's just, I don't, I don't like it. So I'll rather just, when I can go to the gym, I'll just go to the gym. Plus now that I'm getting like older or whatever and just how my schedule is, I like to kind of go to the gym earlier in the morning to get it out the way. And my personal trainer, she is only there from 12 in the afternoon to 5 PM. So that really wouldn't even work for me anyway. Like I would have to get a new trainer, but anyways, I went and did that. And then I went to Target. Why are these two bags $103? Let's be for real. So, got that and then I came back home to some packages. Um, I already opened two for y'all yesterday. So the ones that came today was this one and this big one also came today. And then this other one right here already opened, but I had to get a cute thumbnail so I had to make it look good, girl. So, I'm gonna go ahead and do, we're gonna start with Amazon first since I know that's like what everybody is loving with like my home decor and stuff. So we're gonna do this smaller bag right here. Yesterday I showed y'all my new lighter, electric lighter that was so cool. And then my father's mirror, the wrapping paper, well not wrapping paper, wallpaper. So this came with two items. This one is, oh, my LED night lights. I got it in a four pack. Super cute, modern, everything like that. Let's use my box cutter since, you know, that's why I bought it. Box cutter and everything is linked in my Amazon storefront as well. Okay. I wanted these lights because, I mean, they're cute. And I like to kind of have a night light. Like when I leave prints, I like to keep night lights on in my guest room is where I leave him. And then, you know, just in here, I like to keep lights, you know, when I'm walking. I just like to have night lights and I wanted cuter night lights. Like, that's just it. So they're soft light, they're light censored for um, daytime and nighttime. So I don't have to like turn them on and off. They'll automatically shut off when it gets light outside. And then they don't flicker and it's energy saving. So I'm super excited to try this out. I guess you just turn it on like that and then plug it in and then yeah i guess you can adjust the brightness and stuff like that so we're gonna try these out super excited i got a four pack because you know why well, just have two that came in this one is oh this is prince new harness um definitely needed one of these for a while now the one i got for him was from five below and i absolutely loved it 
but it's kind of the velcro on it isn't sticking as good as it used to so i've been looking for one y'all know i had bought one from i want to say home goods and i didn't really care for it i hope this fit him i got an extra small he kind of tiny looking at the reviews so got an extra small it's just blue and gray i like this one because although it has velcro when the velcro kind of stops working i will still be able to clip it right here Prince old harness, the Velcro is behind the clip. So like the clip is all the way up here and the Velcro is on the back. So it's like the back of it be like flapping open and baby, we don't, we don't need that. So really I just needed the harness, but it also came with the new um, leash as well. So I'll probably use this so he can stop trying to run everywhere. So yeah, I'm super excited. We're gonna try, see if this fit him right now cause he all up in my business anyway. He was just sniffing my bags. I'm gonna put in a, a clip. I didn't get him sniffing the bags, but I got him when I caught him in my bags. And he looked like, girl, come over here, over here. I'm trying to get you over here. Come here. That he steps into, oh, it's just a little too small. Uh, now I gotta go back to Kohl's and return this. I just went, oh, I went to Kohl's too and returned two things. Oh, wow, I should've got a small, okay. <laughs> I had a, I got two more packages coming today. One of them is a mirror. I'm just gonna tell y'all that. It got pushed back until tomorrow. So yeah, that's no fun, but I'm not even gonna have my little entryway table until Wednesday. So I mean, it's fine. All right, this one is only three items. So y'all know I love the Febreze bread and I love the game scent. Um, needed some more of these, smell good. Can't wait to have my house smelling like wood. Here in my pants. <laughs> um, sir, can I help you? Like, he, you, you really get my stuff? Oh, it's, he got his toy over there. He may be trying to just get his toy. Earlier, he was like all in my bag. So anyways, got the game. And then I got a, this is tiny. Uh-uh white extendable tripod okay so i needed a new tripod but this is like really small and compact that may be a good or bad thing so the one that i got y'all on right now the tripod is still good it's the piece that you tighten a piece of that broke off so now like my camera sometimes get a little wop-sided so i got this one and girl this is small i might need this small one though because when i be out in public trying to like take this big tripod and stuff it'd be a little bit too much so i like to use a handheld tripod which where is it of course the day that i need something right there is not right there so this is the manfredo brand of the tripod which this is still pretty you know small and compact but look how tiny that one is compared to that so this one may be a little bit better for me as well like being in public i don't know why i've been vlogging for like so many years seven eight years and i still get shy sometimes so i think this one will be really nice so yeah it's tiny but it said it extended i hope i don't gotta return this because i need it i need a tripod for like my camera did i buy the wrong tripod it say white extended tripod how do you extend it oh girl okay no ma'am is <laughs> yes. i need a tripod like this that y'all on right now this is the type of tripod i need something small slim but like a bigger tripod now i'm pissed because none of my stuff is coming out right my pillow for my bathtub um when i take bubble baths i like to just kind of lay down relax and chill and yeah i be needing something on my back and on my neck so i got this hopefully it works out well for me since everything else isn't working out so this is probably something that you put it in to wash it in the washing machine i got this one because everyone was saying this one is a really good suction and it just feels really nice so i can have some back support and then i can have some neck support right here so i'm super excited back first because this is all the stuff that I got that's not clothing items. So like I said, I wanted to do like a fall inspired shower routine, um, nighttime routine, something like that. So I got the Dove body scrub and brown sugar and coconut butter. 
super excited to try this one it smells really good um I had bought the yellow top before and it smelled good in store but when I actually used it in the shower it almost made me throw up so I hope this doesn't do the same thing I hope it smells good while I'm in the shower also using it so and then pertaining to that still fall aesthetic I went and picked up the pampering shea butter and vanilla I used to use this all the time anyway so this isn't really something that I'm just trying to be fall with and then this one though i haven't used this one i think i see all the girlies using this one um the radiant cocoa uh, body oil and cocoa butter it smelled pretty good in store i never used it before but hopefully it'll have me you know out here all pretty and oiled up next things i got is a candle i got the two wood candles these are two for ten dollars it's the mini size i got whiskey and oat and then i got leather and inverse empress something like that mm, but they smell so good can't wait to use these i'm going to be lighting these for the fall aesthetic or my bath and body works ones that i got if y'all saw that haul next few things i got is like skincare health stuff like that i got some um castor oil the premium hair oil i like to use the jamaican black castor oil but this was three dollars compared to that one was like eight or nine so we're gonna go with this one i still think this is a pretty good brand i used to buy this from the beauty supply store and then i always wanted to try the ordinary brand um i just got the i wanted to get the cleanser but the cleanser is like nine or ten dollars and i feel like it's like a really tiny cleanser so yeah anyways this one was only six dollars picked this up wanted to try this one out so i hope this hope it does what it says it's going to do okay and then the next thing i got is y'all know i love my melatonin i like the ollie brand literally i can take one and they like ko i'm knocked out and i bought some clothes from target i've never bought any clothes from target like i've gotten like a little tank top a little shirt or you know like little stuff and i literally like went shopping shopping y'all look how close he is like back up all right this was five dollars i needed just another black little bitty everyday basic um crop top it's not even cropped on me because i got a size medium but yeah i just needed a new black basics and then the next thing i got i shouldn't have got this but they had 30 percent off all day um, women accessory like clothes and accessories it was 25 dollars, so 30 percent off of that um it's just a bodysuit well, not a bodysuit. It's a jumpsuit. I got a size medium. And I wish this would have came in a size black. I think I recorded a picture trying it on. I'll probably pop that in. But it's cute. I got a size medium. It makes you look good in all the right places. It, it just feels really nice. And this, I got it so that I can layer it when fall times come. Well, I can't slow down talking. I got this so that I can layer this for when actual fall come. Like, it's fall right now, but it's not cold. Like, it's still giving 80 degrees outside right now. So, I can wear this right now or I can wear it when the fall, like, when it actually gets cooler outside with, like, a jacket, some Ugg boots, stuff like that. So, I got this. I like the jumpsuit. It's super cute. Like, quality always 10 out of 10. Then I got these little, like, yoga pants or just lounge around pants it also came with a shirt but i guess everybody bought the little like long sleeve shirt that it come with because they only had a size extra small and baby triple d's ain't getting no extra small okay so this was regular 20 dollars with 30 percent off i got it in the size medium love these Bay was on the phone with me while i was trying these on he was like yeah he approved he said some other stuff but i can't i, can't, I can't say all that okay and then the last thing that i got is some jeans from target girl like Target got some good jeans. I ain't never bought no jeans from there. Um, these are regular $28. I got them in a size 4. I think I was talking about my sizing before. Um, the 4 fits, but I may... Like, I feel like I can wear like a 4 or a 6, if that makes sense. Like, I'm 145, 46 pounds. Um, so, yeah. But these I liked. And it has a little cut out right here as well like i don't know i just think that's cute especially with like i said winter time coming and then when it gets a little bit colder in the fall um i'm gonna need some really good quality jeans so that i can just you know wear different tops with it layer different things like that so i've been trying to buy good quality jeans and i actually like these i like that the um waist isn't like huge it kind of takes you in and then it's just 
their their 90s were like straight so i got a size 4 29 inseam um 29 is cool i would like 30 or 32 but you know it's all good so yeah i actually really like these like target got some good good clothes if y'all um shop at target for like clothes and stuff comment down below you know some stuff that i can look at or try out or something so yeah i like these i'm gonna go ahead and wash these as well because when i was trying these on i dropped these on the floor and then they are really long so they kind of got on the ground so y'all supposed to be washing y'all stuff anyway but i know some people don't but i'm definitely making sure that i wash these because they did kind of touch the ground so I'm going to be using my little tripod that I got to record like a little TikTok or something. So. All right, enough with the phone footage. I plan to put the mirror right here at the 24 inch, if I'm not mistaken. Um, didn't want it to be too big because obviously it's not a big you know spot right there so this is how you install black brush metal frame high definition mirror hd mirror and shadow proof mirror yeah i'm not gonna hang it just yet until i actually get my um entryway table but just to make sure it fits perfectly i didn't want it to be overly big like taking up this whole wall i just wanted it to be you know really cute so the table i can't remember how high it comes up it probably comes up to about like right here maybe so yeah i'm not gonna put up anything until i get that i'm getting the table later today say it'll be here by 7 15. hopefully it comes before then like at six o'clock or before six because i do gotta go to work today and i don't really like to keep my packages outside even though i'm gonna be back in 12 hours i would just like for myself to be inside sometime Ooh, excuse me sometimes i leave work if it's like a big box or something i'll leave work come take it in on my lunch break or something like that so i may or may not do that we'll see um because you know i got a ring camera and stuff as well but yeah i'm super excited this is gonna be so cute um i wasn't wanting to put anything right here but honestly it just seems kind of blah like plain and i would definitely don't mind my hair like my hair is not doing this thing today <laughs> but I think this will be cute and y'all know all of my stuff is black so it's just it's just gonna be perfect so super excited to hang this i may because i don't want it too high like why would i have it all the way up here you know so my height probably like just right above the light fixture probably like right here i'll hang it so that i can still like take pictures look at myself whatever before i leave out the door just a regular all black vase nothing too extravagant it was thirty dollars this is how it looks i think this would be so cute to put on my little entryway table so that's why i want to wait to hang the mirror until i actually set the table up and put what i want on there because obviously i don't want things like covering the mirror so this one is it's kind of tall so i mean i can put it on either the top level of the table or the bottom i got the two tier one or the two shelf one and then i saw I was looking at this white one right here. If we can zoom into that. I was looking at that one as well, but most of my stuff, like all of my furniture and everything is black. So I think I'm just gonna do that. Plus the table is marble with black, oh, that's UPS. Plus it's marble with black um, like legs. So yeah, they also had a smaller little circle base right there, but this one definitely got my attention right there. So this is what I'm thinking it's thinking to do so since i have one right here i guess i won't put one right here like i do have a night light but girl this ain't cute like and plus the top of this i didn't lost so it's, it's it's just not given so i don't know we'll just keep this if i really really like need this but aesthetically we about to have these ones up right here so 
it depends on like you know what I put on the entryway table and stuff so I may keep that right there if it doesn't like fit properly then I'll put this one over there and then I still want to put like right here I don't want to put nothing right there because it's going to be kind of blocked off so I was thinking and I don't want to put one in the kitchen up here either because I mean I have this whole light that goes all the way around and it goes into my bar. So I don't know where I really wanna put the rest of these at. Like maybe I'll put one in my room, but I like to have that right there. I don't know y'all. I don't know, I'll figure it out. Second every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Tell them dim the lights down right now. Put me in the mood. I'm talking about dark room perfume. Go, go. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. Ooh, and I know your taste this a little bit. Mm, high maintenance. Ooh. Everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis With poetic justice, poetic justice I told you that a flower bloom in the dark room What you trusted, I mean I write poems in these songs Dedicated to you when You're in the mood for empathy, it's blood in my pen Better yet, your friends and him I really wanna know you all I really wanna show you all Fuck that, cold, play me, champagne Cold nights when you curse this man You called up your friends and I heard that she wanna go and party She wanna go and party Nigga don't approach her with that Atari Nigga that ain't good game home is sorry They say conversation, rule a nation I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs Unless I write it down for real P.S. I really hope you played it Cause old girl you test my patience With all these seductive photographs And all these one-off patients you Clearly a lot for me to take in, it don't make sense. Young East African girl, too busy fucking with your other man. Hey y'all, today is Saturday, November 28th, and it is raining. Not sure if you guys can tell. It's not raining too bad right now. It's 5:10 in the afternoon. I didn't wake up until like 12 today. I am about to go to Target for a pickup. It says my stuff is ready. Um, Target, y'all know I bought those um pants, like the clothing items from there and they had 30% off all women's clothing and stuff. So now they have a spend over $25, get $5 back in the, as a gift card for, um, what is it? I guess like hygiene items. Like I got vitamins because I need to re-up on my vitamins so I'm getting $5 back, but I just got vitamins and I got mouthwash because I needed some more mouthwash. So anyways, they got some deals going on. Go to Target, baby, okay? But I am about to be on my way there um, doing a pickup. Um, like I said, getting my vitamins mouthwash. And I'm also getting this base because I am going to go ahead and start putting up um, the rest of my Amazon stuff. <laughs> I went and got the packages and stuff today, the ones that just got delivered. So I'm about to hurry up and head out before it gets dark because if y'all know me, y'all know I do not like to drive when it's dark outside especially when it's raining i'm gonna close this as well for right now so i don't feel like blurring out too much so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna hold this too okay baby i'm about to do any of y'all judge other drivers like on the road to see how fast their windshield wipers are going. Like if it's not raining that bad and I'm looking over at the next person or something, you know, they windshield wipers just, you know, go up every like five seconds, 10 seconds. I'm like, all right, all right. Like, let me turn my down a little bit. Like, obviously I'm gonna, you know, do what I need to do like to see, but I don't know. I be looking around trying to judge and see how fast people got their windshield wipers going so i kind of got mine going a little fast as you can hear right now i'm gonna turn them down a little bit mine have a lot of different speeds on them like baby you know you saw me coming 
all right anyways i have a lot of different speeds and like settings and stuff on mine so mine ain't going too crazy right now but anyways yeah i'm about to come back home put together my new entryway table i'm picking up a vase as well i'm not sure if i showed you guys that on a vlog or not i want to say i did but i'm going to go ahead and pick up that vase as well as what else did i get today my little um self-care bath table so yeah i'm gonna talk to y'all when i get to tarjay so i can focus on the road we are here and my hair is like not going to play all right i'm here i'm in space 22 no 2012. show your code you're in space 12. baker got my drive-in code or drive up code and i need to remember to look this way i should have parked the other way so i could see him walking because i think last time i was either talking to y'all i was doing something up here and girl i'm just really talking and then he had to knock on the door i'm like oh i thought you was coming from like the actual door like the way we go into target but in my target they switched this one so now they don't come out that door anymore um they put like 20 something spots over here and they actually have like a drive up section so they just come out like the little like drive up door or whatever oh my eyes are burning <laughs> turn my windshield wipers off <sighs> i'm tired the rain has just made me just even more sleepy sluggish tired today on top of i worked three days this week y'all know i went part-time so i only i'm only required to work two but yeah your girl worked three one of my friends she asked me if i could work her split today and baby i had to say no <laughs> because i told her i do not want to see my job this week until next week and i also said it's you know storming i don't like to get out when it's raining at night time so i'm trying to hurry up and do what i gotta do because the split shift i would have to go to work at like 12 at night or 12 30 since we work 12 hour shifts we work six and then another person will come in and work the other six so especially since i'm not doing the first half i'm just tired i want to relax they need to come on baby because i'm ready to go i'm hungry as well i ate a little bit of leftover pasta that i made yesterday um chick-fil-a is right here the only other close thing is like Genghis grill chipotle mcdonald's down the road that way so i might just stop and give me some chick-fil-a just so i don't have to cook today because i got to do an online grocery pickup as well tomorrow sunday so you know we got to restock i have no food left the food that i bought the last time that lasted me about two weeks um so yeah i kind of just shopped for two weeks and yeah i'm gonna do an online grocery pickup today or tonight i'm not gonna do too much just i need some meat and like some sides and that's really it i still got slightly some snacks so yeah i see someone rolling in on this cart there's one person ahead of me there's another guy down there in 16 and i'm in 12 so they may just go down the road we'll see i'm gonna have to roll down my window anyway i told him to give it to me instead of putting it in my trunk because especially since i got a vase maybe i'll be whipping so i didn't want the vase to be slanging around in the trunk and potentially break so and i had did my eyebrows because i didn't want to get on here looking crazy like i was going to do my hair and everything but girl i'm tired like i'm tired thank you thank you baby I guess he wanted to say hey to y'all something because he didn't look right over here at the camera okay this vase is a little bit heavier than i thought it was going to be <laughs> i picked it up in there they only had two left in my location so girl if y'all local and y'all around where i'm around y'all better go get it so she's 30 dollars. she's the threshold vase cannot wait till i got inside to show y'all this is so cute hopefully it looks right on this table because girl i didn't even put the table up yet we just buying stuff and i didn't put the table up so got that and then what is he looking at oh somebody forgot something they're not even looking he's trying to flag them down yep missed them he forgot to give him some. 
Not on being nosy, girl. Okay, and y'all know I had picked up these pre and probiotics last time. I really liked them. Um, I mean, I finished my whole 30 count, and I'm just going to continue to use them. Um, I feel like they've been working, but, you know, we'll see. And then this is the obviously brand that everybody loves to use i love to use this brand for mouthwash has to re-up on that i like the blue kind or the blue bottle i haven't checked i haven't um tried out a different one because you know if i like something i just kind of want to stick with it i don't want to get something that i don't like and then also i went ahead and got some vitamin d <laughs> gummies because it supports immune bone teeth and muscle health just got this brand it, it had pretty good reviews i guess it's a 150 count and you take two a day yeah um i got this because my periods are tmi for the girlies but anyways my periods are very irregular like i used to have like in high school i used to have a period every other month so like i will skip a month for instance i would have one january skip february have one march now since i got off of birth control and don't say get on birth control because i do not want to get on birth control like i'm done i've been on birth control for maybe about a year and a half or two years um and i'm loving it but um yeah now my periods are like every three months and i'm like this is nice but i'm kind of tired of it like i wish i would just have a regular period i used to have a regular one sometimes but i wish i would just have a regular menstrual cycle to where i get it every month and then i'm on it for you know let me make sure i ain't hit nobody i'm on it for like you know three to four days maybe even a week that's cool because since i'm getting it every three months sometimes it's two sometimes it's three it's like very kind of unpredictable i mean it's irregular what can you say but other times it's like my period is a lot longer than just like a week sometimes it's two weeks and that whole time it's not really just like heavy bleeding like sometimes it's just spotting or whatever but i got the whole reason of this me explaining this is because i got the vitamin d because i was online trying to see how to like naturally regulate like your period and it was like maybe you're lacking in vitamin d so i'm like okay let me pick up some vitamin d and they're like repaving this and this is just like so horrible so yeah i got vitamin d for that reason because baby we're trying to get this back regular okay it's chick-fil-a crowded Cause girl, I'm hungry. We're gonna be it. It's gonna be a guy right here. It's what in my wallet. Oops. Can I do Afterpay? Not Afterpay, Apple Pay. Okay, cause I don't got my wallet. And what's a good name for this? Word? Baker. All right, what can I get for you today? I want the eight-count nugget meal with ketchup and a lemonade. Okay. Anything else? No, that's all. All right, so you got an eight-count nugget, medium fry, medium lemonade, ketchup. Your mm -hmm. total will be $10.28. And all right, you're good to go. Thank you. Oh, I can't believe I always forget my wallet. You know what? Because I was at work and I didn't unpack my bag, my work bag. So it's in that bag. Baby, I'm glad I ain't go in nowhere. I sure don't got it. Let me get back to the house because I don't like driving when I ain't got like my wallet and stuff. You know, I be trying to, you know, I don't like that. All right. And I don't know why I always say, do y'all got afterpay? They probably like, girl, afterpay for some Chick-fil-A. Mm -mm. I say it every time. And it's like, I don't even use Afterpay that much. I be using Zip Pay. So, anyways, I want my food. I'm hungry here. Mm, mm, mm. I'm going to do my hair tomorrow, though. If this vlog is drug out to tomorrow, we're going to see. Because I still have to organize my closet, my guest room closet. Not even or well, organize, just kind of straighten it up. I just got stuff thrown everywhere. So, once we put this console table together, put all my stuff up, I'm going to clean up a little bit, and then I'm going to do that. Take it. You're the drum cadence. Little red light special. Yes. And if y'all wondering what this is, it's a pillow. I think I said it in my last vlog. I got it because I be needing something to rest my neck on. So that's that. 
linked in my description box. I guess that is sweet. Yes. Thank you. I had a drink also. <laughs> Sorry about that, man. Thank you. You too. His pleasure. Okay. I love that Chick fil A do that, baby, because, yeah. And I'm not going that way since they took all that gravel off because you ain't about to mess up my car. My car already sit low. And baby, I don't need nothing else happening because I did kind of run over something before, like a few months back. So it's like the little, not my bumper, but like whatever is like under that, that little black piece is like on one side, it's kind of hanging. But we ain't gonna talk about it. We ain't gonna talk about it. don't forget to check my description box um a lot of y'all have been using my referral code and i think it gives y'all like 100 points as well as me um literally i just put it down there because why not get you know money back i didn't got a 10 dollars amazon gift card for doing this every receipt you scan it it don't matter if it's a gas receipt food shopping whatever so make sure to check the box and get my code yeah get off my cup off the cup This means he needs to go outside. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh, watch out. Oh, I got this harness for him. I wanted to show y'all his harness. They actually delivered it yesterday. I went and picked it up today. Um, the one... The box that he just got done sniffing is actually the harness that doesn't fit. So I'm gonna take this back tomorrow or maybe the next day if it's not raining too bad. And down there, I'm gonna open that package when we get back. But it's cute, I like it. I did put it on backwards last time. So that little, this is the brand that I got. It'll be linked down my Amazon storefront. That's the brand. This goes in the front of their face or like up where their face is at. So I don't really need this leash because I like to use the retractable leash just so that he can go pretty far, especially since it's wet and muddy outside. Like it'll allow him to, you know, kind of go where he needs to go. But I'm going to use it right now just so that he doesn't get into like too much water, mud puddles and stuff like that. Um, this goes in the front. So I'm going to hook it, put on his new little harness. I like it. It feels really sturdy and it's also reflective in the um, dark time. Alright. Put your stuff on, little boy. Alright. Oh. Okay, perfect. So it's cute. And then they have different colors like pink, purple, green, I believe. So I'm just gonna use this. I'm gonna see how I like it. It kinda has not really a lot of stretch. It got like a little bounce back to it, but yeah, I'm super excited. I'm about to put on my rain boots because it's like wet outside. <laughs> and I hate rain boots like this because the soles in them just start raising up. All right. It says it's 63 degrees outside. It's not too cold, so I'm just going to take an umbrella. So I originally, like I said, bought a black one of these, but that one didn't come. Guess you can. All right, so this is how long it goes. That's pretty long. And then it just folds up in half. Two spots I can actually put this so right now it's resting on like what I slot the glass door on so if I don't want it right there I can kind of shorten it a little bit I guess and put it well no that may end up falling so 
so I'm probably gonna have to go like that because I can put it like that but I don't think that's too stable I was trying to put it down below on this like lower groove down there as you can see it's like a little dip but it's a little bit too long for that which is fine so I don't ever close the door anyway honestly so I just leave it like that little soap thing right here put my wine in right here for a glass and then I guess yeah so then I put my iPad right there and with this um I guess you just stick this in I see a little hole right here and then should be another hole right there yep and then I can put my iPad whatever right here and I can put a candle so I can take the candle down, put the candle right there if I wanted to. See, I'm excited for a little bubble bath. And then my pillow, I just have it hanging right here. So I'll probably let it hang down once I'm done, like taking a bath or whatever. But let's try to see if it'll stick. Yeah. So I also have this. Bay got this for me from Amazon for my birthday this year. So 
probably gonna put her over here as well. I don't know the placement of where I want stuff yet. Because I kind of want to put something inside of this base. So it's like, I don't know if I want it in the middle, up top, or on the side here. I feel like right here, it may not be the best place because that could happen. I had another one of these. I have one of these in my living room. Spray painted this black. This used to be gray. You can still kind of see a little bit on the inside and the bottom, it's not black. This one is Sugar Snickerdoodle. Had this since either earlier this year, like January, February, or since last year. It's almost done, but she smells amazing. Got that. And then I showed this in my last vlog. Got this from Home Goods. I've been using it to hold my remote, so I'll probably go back to Home Goods and get another one of these because I actually liked having this in my living room so i put the remotes in but i did specifically buy this to put over here so we'll see and then i can put some stuff in here i already have a key holder so i don't gotta put my keys over there all right so i'll probably check on pinterest and whatever else and see what else i can like put up here or like how to style it so Right now, I'm probably not gonna keep this like that. I'm gonna be playing around with it, but I'm just trying to sit everything that I know I want over here, over there. And with these, I'm not sure where these go. Um, I think the people in the reviews had it like this. I feel like that's gonna fall off though. And I honestly don't really like that. Like everything else is matte black. Why are they giving silver? I'm trying to see where I want this. Oh, gorgeous. Okay, this is about the center. Should probably want to go get some help, but you know what? I'm not new to this, I'm true to this. All right, so I think I want it about right here because if I'm standing, that'd be cute. Like I don't want it all the way up here. I want it about right here. Probably right here. So these are the two screws that they, I had to change my glasses cause the other one was sliding. These are the two screws they gave me this is a screw that i already have like a box of so i'm going to use this one for the middle because obviously it's longer so it can be a little bit more secure so this is going to go in the middle these other two is going to go on the side Make sure I got it in the center before I do the other two. Get on the, side. the mirror isn't heavy at all, honestly. Okay. Honestly, one screw might just work because like I said, that's a very, very deep screw, but I'm also gonna put that little sticky command thing right here. I think this is cute. The height is looking well. I like it. I like it a lot. Girl, I'm glad I put this into work. I'm eyeballing placement. We just gonna see if that work out. fine i'm gonna go ahead and take off this sticky piece on the bottom that's um the command stickiness right there and then we're gonna stick her to the wall Girl, 
it be the aftermath for me. Like, so excited for all these packages just cleaned up. And yeah, all these boxes everywhere. So I wish I would have told my boyfriend to take those other boxes out when he was over here. But literally got that, all of this. And then we still got, not him over there, <laughs> all of these boxes as well. So I'm about to clean up this mess. I am tired, too tired to, um, can I rub my eyebrows off? Oh. I be having to switch back and forth between glasses. Anyways, I'm too tired to straighten up my guest room closet tonight. So we're going to do that tomorrow. I would like to get up early and go to church in the morning. So I want to clean up my mess in here. Unpackage the rest of this little stuff from Target. And... I already ate Chick-fil-A, but I'm honestly hungry again. I'll probably cook like some pizza rolls or something real quick because, oh, I need to put in my grocery order. And then, yeah, we'll get to go do that tomorrow. I'm going to do my grocery pickup order for like 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, I should be either up or done with whatever I'm doing by that time. So we're going to order some groceries tonight. And then we're going to finish this apartment vlog, moving vlog, whatever, tomorrow. Because the other thing I got left to do is figure out how I really want to set this up over here. I'm liking it for now, hopefully. I said in the last vlog I didn't want to put a mirror right here because it'll probably freak me out looking out of here. But I do sleep with my door closed, so it, it'll be okay. But yeah, I'm liking it right now. The, um table is really slim i wanted something really small that'll fit right here that wouldn't make this too big so i'm gonna play around with some stuff find some more stuff for that table or whatever and yeah i'm i'm pooped it's 7 30 and i'm already tired i'm probably gonna take my either i'm gonna take my sleep if if i take my sleeping pill it's gonna make me hungry i ain't got nothing to eat girl so i'll probably just take two ollie melatonins um tonight i'll probably take that at like 9 uh, 32 o'clock I like the way to open the door until they walk away. Good morning. It's 8.49 in the morning and I look a mess still. <laughs> still in my PJs. Here's a mess, girl. I literally went to bed just like this. All right, he's almost down the stairs, so then I'm gonna open the door. I guess someone, cause you need a coat to get into my apartment complex. So I guess someone was already coming in. Usually, Bay, he don't ever have to call me either because someone is always coming in and people just trail behind him, which I don't like that. <laughs> so, and I like this. Like, how y'all can see this, it just, I like that. It just makes it mm, a little more homey. Church starts in 10 minutes. <laughs> I was trying to wait until my stuff got here. Um, I'm gonna pull it up on oh, my phone. <sighs> they usually don't start preaching until 30 minutes in anyway.
It starts in eight minutes and six seconds. So there's a little countdown until it starts. So we still got, oh, we got seven minutes and 58 seconds. So I'm gonna put these few little groceries away. I need to return this today. Bay is gonna stop over here after he get done at the new church that he's playing for here. So I just ordered a few, just a few things to kind of get me through this week. Some pizza that I shouldn't be eating, but you know, got potatoes. I got, baby, come on now. Y'all done squished my whole hamburger bun. Got squished up hamburger buns, girl. And I didn't just use my hamburger meat <laughs> that I was gonna have for sandwich, but whatever. Got bread. What's this? Oh, they gave me the can of ragu. I hate that. I know they have to like do this as like protocol or whatever, but I hate when they put one item in like one bag or like two items. I know they gotta separate stuff, but girl. And I'm surprised they put this meat and stuff. They usually put the meat in a separate thing, but I got chicken wings. I got a Lunchable. I got some bacon so I can cook me some breakfast. I got milk. And then y'all know I love my smoked sausages. <sighs> Last bag. Rotel with no Velveeta cheese. Cream of chicken, definitely need that. Another can of cream of chicken. Needed to re-up on chicken broth. And then literally for a snack, I like to eat fruit, so I got peaches. Like I said, this ain't no full grocery shopping, nothing. It's just something that'll get me for the rest of the week. And then I'm also gonna go to my friend Janae, her apartment. Oh, I got me a 24 pack of Sprite that I don't need. <laughs> but listen, my friend Janae, um, I don't think I recorded her baby shower. Um, but yeah, she obviously is about to have a baby. So she, you know, get weak and all of that stuff. So like the little stuff like that, um, I'm gonna go shopping, grocery shopping at her house. <laughs> and yeah, get the rest of like the little stuff that I can get from her. I'm gonna put these groceries away. And I got five minutes until service start. And then I'm about to do my like, Oh, I'm tired. My morning hygiene, girl. I'll talk to y'all a little bit later in the day. I love this church. I love what God's doing here. And uh, believe in our mission of making disciples and live by God's grace and for his glory at home and across the world. Well, hey, if you're new or not connected here, we would love to get to know you. Uh, maybe if this is your first time here, if you're joining online, we'd love to get to know you and your story. And so we got this place called the Connection Center just outside. 86 people uh, watching this morning. If you're leaving the exit today, we'd love for you to stop by and get to know you. <laughs> So I actually decided to just chill and relax for the rest of the day and I did not clean out my closet or anything like that. So that's going to be in a different vlog. Um, yeah, I just started to chill. So I'm taking my morning vitamins, listening to, you know, my church service and stuff like that. And I wanted to piggyback off what I was talking about in the car when we were sitting outside of Target. I took this vitamin D gummies and about two to three days later, my period started. So if you are looking for like a natural way to try to make your irregular period regular i would suggest taking actual vitamin d um i used to take a women multivitamin and like i said it had vitamin d in that but i think actually taking the vitamin d has helped me tremendously this is about like four or five days after this clip here in my period um well my cycle was only about like five days four to five days me with an irregular period my last um cycle was literally about three weeks i can't remember if i told y'all that in the car or not but it wasn't like i was like fully on my period it was like kind of spotting or whatever so yeah i will say i am really enjoying taking these vitamins i am so glad i looked it up and just decided to try the vitamin d so as always don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe we're almost to 30k and until my next video i will see you lovely stand.